In recent years, Springfield, Ohio, has seen a notable influx of Haitian immigrants, transforming the city both demographically and socially. With estimates suggesting that around 12,000 to 20,000 Haitians now call Springfield home, this community has rapidly become a significant part of the local landscape. The reasons behind their migration are as varied as the individuals themselves, but a common thread emerges, Springfield offers job opportunities and supportive services that appeal to new arrivals seeking stability and a better future. The migration wave began about five years ago, driven by a combination of factors including economic hardship and political instability in Haiti. Springfield, with its welcoming environment and affordable living conditions, became an attractive destination. According to Lynn Helsey, a reporter who has extensively covered the Haitian community in Springfield, many immigrants chose this city because it provided a viable alternative to more costly areas and offered supportive services to help them integrate. However, this rapid growth has not come without its challenges. The local infrastructure, including schools and non-profit organizations, has been strained by the sudden increase in population. The city's resources have been stretched thin, as these institutions work to accommodate the needs of the growing Haitian community. Mayor Rob Rue has acknowledged the pressure on local services, noting that while the numbers may vary, the impact is significant. Complicating matters is the broader national debate over immigration. As Springfield has become a focal point in discussions about immigration policy, the city has faced unwelcome attention and misinformation. Some of the more sensational claims, such as those made during recent presidential debates, have fueled controversy and distracted from the real issues facing both the Haitian community and local authorities. These rumors have included baseless accusations about immigrants engaging in criminal activities, which have only served to heighten tensions. In response to these challenges, local leaders are working to address practical concerns. Initiatives include efforts to improve access to driving education for Haitian immigrants, addressing language barriers, and navigating the complex U.S. immigration system. These efforts are crucial as they help immigrants integrate more effectively into their new community and mitigate some of the strain on local resources. Additionally, the temporary protected status, that is TPS, granted to many Haitians in Springfield allows them to live and work in the U.S. legally, though it does not provide a direct path to citizenship. The extension of TPS until February 2026 offers a degree of stability, but the long-term prospects remain uncertain and complex. Overall, the Haitian immigrant community in Springfield represents both an opportunity and a challenge for the city. While their presence enriches the local culture and economy, it also tests the limits of community resources and prompts a re-evaluation of how best to support all residents. As Springfield navigates this evolving situation, it is clear that addressing the needs of this growing population will require both empathy and practical solutions from all sectors of the community. Stay subscribed for more videos.